Hello everyone, it's me, James Fisher, and this is how I became an official member of the National Society of Leadership and Success, otherwise commonly referred to as the NSLS. The NSLS is an honor society and I'm going to be going through the academic GPA requirements to join. For undergraduate students, the qualifying cumulative GPA is 3.0. And for graduate students, the cumulative GPA is a 3.5. As a student of Southern New Hampshire University, the other requirement is that students must have a total of nine credits earned before they're eligible for the nomination to the NSLS. I'm an online student at Southern New Hampshire University, and I received a nomination invitation through my SNHU Outlook email. I'm going to read out the email that I received. Dear nominee, we want to commend you for having met the eligibility criteria for membership in the National Society of Leadership and Success, NSLS. Nominations are awarded to only a small percentage of online Southern New Hampshire University students, so congratulations on earning your invitation to become a member. Should you choose to accept this prestigious honor, you will become part of a driven, like-minded community that is focused on achieving success. That was the invitation email that I received. I will now be showing some footage that I vlogged of myself going through the process of becoming an official member of the NSLS. I've gotten into the National Society of Leadership and Success, and I'm about to start my orientation. Okay, so it looks like I have to watch an orientation video and then answer some orientation questions. I'm not showing it because it might be confidential information. But essentially they're asking about the mission, benefits, steps to induction, and what activities I need to complete after the orientation is approved. So, I'm going to watch the video and... See what happens. I've just submitted my orientation and next I have to do all these things before I can get accepted as an official member. I'm going to be watching the leadership training day video and answering the questions tomorrow because I'm a little tired. I don't think I can focus on watching a 40 minute video and answering questions right now. Here's an update. I'm going to be continuing my leadership training day probably tomorrow after my group meeting. The first meeting is tomorrow at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, which will be 8 a.m. my time, which means I have to sleep soon, but I want to complete my assignments. And I still haven't finished the Leadership Day video and answered the questions. So I have to do that. And here I have my soya milk. And I went out to get these mint slices by Arnott's. These were only about three to four dollars. And They're exactly the same as the Girl Scout cookies that I used to get in high school. Look at that. And I like to dip it in my soya milk. Mmm. That's the mint and chocolate biscuit. They're really good. I would definitely buy these again. I like mint and chocolate, but in this biscuit form. I'm not a big fan of mint and chocolate ice cream. I used to be, but then I started realizing that it tastes a little bit too much like toothpaste. So now I prefer the combination of mint and chocolate, but only if there is a greater percentage of chocolate. Now back to work. I just finished my first success networking meeting. And I got to meet some new people and talk about SMART goals. I have to refine my SMART goals and make it work.
The SMART goal that I mentioned was that I was going to post more regularly on YouTube. I was thinking maybe posting every Saturday and editing my videos on Wednesday. Today is Wednesday, so I should probably start editing my video now and then have it posted by Saturday of this week. I have to get started on that. And at the same time, still do my university assignments and everything. I hope I can keep up with this SMART goal. But yeah, so that's the plan. Also, I swear, I have more clothes than this. I just really like to wear this sweatshirt. I know I've been in this for almost the entire video, but I'm going to change out of it soon. The next time you see me, I won't be wearing this. I hope. I, I don't know. This sweater says, your mentality is your reality. I think it's very true. I'm going to be watching my leadership training day video and writing notes so I can answer the questions and submit it. I've submitted my leadership training day answers. I just have to wait. And I submitted my ST report for the first meeting. The second ST meeting got postponed to tomorrow morning, Thursday. EST 7 p.m. which means I have to wake up early tomorrow at 7 a.m. Singapore time on Friday for the meeting but I'm going to watch a speaker broadcast before going to bed since I have to watch three of these before I can get accepted I got credit yay I got credit I can finally go to sleep now and wake up for my meeting tomorrow I'm gonna press submit I successfully submitted my second ST meeting. Now we just have two more speaker broadcasts and one more meeting left before I can be fully inducted. ST report got approved and I also received credit for the speaker broadcast. I just have one more thing that I have to complete. I've completed orientation, leadership training day, and I've done two success networking teams. I just have one last one. These were the three broadcasts that I watched and I would say my favorite was the broadcast by Mehdi Hassan and my second favorite would probably be Balsamo St. John and Damon John also had a really great broadcast too. Overall I enjoyed all three of these broadcasts. I felt they were really informative and they taught me a lot. Yay! I've officially made it to induction! I am now an official member of the National Society of Leadership and Success. It's been a few months since I officially became a member of the NSLS and I received my induction kit. I had to pay a grand total of $99.99. .99. So almost about a hundred US dollars, ninety-five dollars for the Foundations of Leadership certificate, and four dollars and ninety-nine cents for the induction kit. For my induction kit, I chose the shirt, and it says Sigma Alpha Pi, because it's the National Society of Leadership and Success Sigma Alpha Pi. And this is the shirt. It's a very nice, clean design. And it says here, established in 2001. And there's nothing in the back. It's just a plain gray shirt in the back. The front is really nice. I like the design of it. Along with this shirt came this. I think it's the certificate. Oh. There's a sticker, National Society of Leadership and Success. Very nice professional logo. That's the sticker that came with the shirt. And of course, I have the certification that I'm officially a member as of April 20th, 2023. These are 
the three things that came in the induction kit that I got. It's a very professional certificate that I should probably get framed. I'm going to keep it in here for now. Don't want it to get wrinkled. I've completed my foundations of leadership, but there are still two more levels of leadership that I can attain through the NSLS. They have the Advanced Leadership Certification and the Executive Leadership Certification as the next two steps up from the Foundations of Leadership Certification. I'm not sure when I will be doing the other two certifications, but I think I'm going to be doing the Advanced Leadership Certification later this year, maybe closer towards the end of the year. And that's all that I have for you. I hope the sharing was informative, insightful, and interesting. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!